Carter. I can't believe the day is finally here. The day I've been dreaming of since I was a little girl. Our wedding day. I couldn't imagine it with anyone more perfect. Who knew that talking to that cute boy in my math class would turn into something as amazing as this? You are truly my soulmate and I can't wait to call you my husband. I don't tell you enough how thankful I am for you, but I know I wouldn't want to do this life with anyone else. You are kind, compassionate, and bring joy and light to everyone around you. It is such a joy to both love you and be loved by you. You have been my rock, my shoulder to cry on, my support, and my home. We have had so many amazing memories in the last eight years, but I can't wait to continue building our lives together and making even better ones. I absolutely cannot wait to marry you today. I love you with my whole heart and more, forever, Lily. Lily, the time has finally come and I couldn't be more excited to finally call you my wife. Today is a celebration of the love that we have for each other the past eight years, and I know this is crazy to say, but this is just the beginning. It really is crazy how far we've come and how much we've grown up, not only individually, but as a team. I wouldn't want anyone else to be my teammate. As we take on this beautiful day together, it really is a true representation of how many people have played a special role in this relationship. I did read that the pollen level was very high this morning, so take that into account in case my eyes start to water. <laughs> Let's have ourselves a great day to celebrate our love for each other. You're going to make the most beautiful bride in the world, and I can't wait to see you. Meet you down the aisle, Wolf Carter. Marriage is a bond to be entered into only after considerable thought and reflection. As with any aspect of life, it has cycles, it has ups and downs, trials and triumphs. With understanding this, Lily and Carter have come here today to be joined as one in marriage. Some might say that Lily and Carter are already committed to each other, and none of us would disagree to that. But today they're proclaiming that commitment not only to us, the people closest to them, they're also doing that to the entire world, saying that we love each other, we support each other, and we want to spend the rest of our lives together. Lily and Carter come before God, their families, and their friends, pledging their love and hearts for one another. In today's world, there's plenty of wonderful ways for a couple to celebrate their lives together that don't include marriage. So, some might ask, why get married? Well, it's an excuse to throw a healthy party today, right? <laughs> it's a way to get friends and family from afar to come visit. Those things certainly make a difference. They matter, but it's deeper than that. Marriage is one partner promising to the other that in addition to loving them, that they want to commit themselves to the other for the rest of their lives. It's stating that they'll be here for their partner when they need them most that they will provide comfort, a kind word, and a shoulder to cry on. And when times are good, as we hope they always are, it's a promise that the two of them will be there to laugh together. Marriage is saying that not only do we want to be partners, you want to be partners for life. Please join hands right now. Lily, take Carter to be your husband. Will you love, honor, and cherish him now and forevermore? I do. You promise to hold Carter's hand, look him in the eyes, and listen to his hopes, dreams, and thoughts? I do. Do you promise to always laugh at his goofy jokes? <laughs> I do. <laughs> Carter, do you take Lily to be your wife? Will you love, honor, and cherish her for now and forevermore? I do. Do you promise to hold Lily's hands, listen to her needs, and do the little things that brighten her day? I do. Do you promise to help out with the house projects that Lily dreams up when she's born? Anything <laughs> else to plan on for? I do. <laughs> Perfect. Lily, you can go ahead and place this on Carter's finger. I promise to you, Carter. I promise to you, Carter. Before our family and friends. Before our family and friends. To commit my love to you. To commit my love to you. To respect your individuality. To respect your individuality. To be with you through life's changes. To be with you through life changes. And to nurture and strengthen the love between us. And to nurture and strengthen the love between us. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Carter, as you place this ring on Lily's finger, please repeat after me. 
I promise to you, Lily. I promise to you, Lily. Before our family and friends. Before our family and friends. To commit my love to you. To commit my love to you. To respect your individuality. To respect your individuality. To be with you through life's changes. To be with you through life's changes. And to nurture and strengthen the love between us. And to nurture and strengthen the love between us. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Lily and Carter, you've declared before all of us today and that you will live together in marriage. You have made lifelong promises to each other through your vows and the exchange of wedding rings. Having pledged yourselves to each other in front of all who have witnessed and are assembled here today by the authority vested in me by the state of Wisconsin, it's my great pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. Sure as the sun will rise, I'll be there when 